S U F U I R I A Sufuria. It's for making chai or ugali, vegetables. So I love this. This one is for ten people, and I make another one for ten people, and another one for ten people. So this one three is for thirty people. <laughs> but in Kenya, this one is for only four people. <laughs> because myself, I can drink half a cup of this morning and in the evening. You have to try in the evening before, before having a dinner. You must have chai. Two hours or one hour before dinner. This chai, it's when you are tired, when you have a headache, you don't feel that well, you take a cup of chai, you feel okay. <laughs> you feel relaxed. You feel focused. So chai helps a lot. So I'll start boring water. This is water. I find it very stupid. Yeah. He brought it with him. Yeah. And counter to the counter to the oh sorry. And chai right now. This one will call it one. So counter to Kenyan tradition, we're making one a strong chai with, without milk for anybody who we have prefers that. We have also two types of chai. We have strong chai, strong thing. We don't put milk, but we put sugar. Tea leaves, sugar, and water. And we call it that's for the people who are sick. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we have a lot of people who are sick. Yeah. 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 You can use all the teas, sugar, and water. When the tea is ready, you pass it through the strainer. I'll show you when it's ready. Did you talk about where the tea was grown? Strong tea? Where, yeah, where the tea was grown. 
where, where, where Benson lives, it's a, a very large tea growing area. And actually Benson grows tea on his farm and they take it to a local uh, tea, factory. tea factory, sell it to them, they process it and bag it and they buy it back. And this tea has, is from, uh, from, yeah, I'll pass it around. This is from Benson's um, hometown. It's a pretty small hometown, but they have a tea factory. Is coffee originally from Ethiopia? Coffee, we have coffee in Kenya. We have plenty of coffee in Kenya. We have some big plantations which grow coffee. But that region, Kenya, Ethiopia, that's the birthplace of coffee? The, the first place to, uh, where coffee was grown? That's in East Africa. Is that, is yeah. that right? Yeah, there's yeah. coffee in Ethiopia, Kenya, and Uganda. And in the western, western part, northwestern part of Kenya, in the Rift Valley, it's a huge tea growing area. Where um, close to the largest city, uh, Kericho, that's what they're known for. Uh, tea, tea, uh, tea farms. So tea is a lot more common where he is from than coffee. There's other areas that will grow the coffee. Now I'm going to make strong tea. How many people are drinking strong tea? One, two, three, four, five. Without milk. You don't drink milk? I'll try it well. <laughs> Six? No, I want both. So. Four, okay. Seven, eight, all right. to make. You boil water, put tea leaves, and all the sugar. So that's all. This is tea. When it boils, I put sugar. <laughs> <laughs> 